course. Welcome all aboard, everyone, for this wonderful wintertime variety show concert here. Of course, on a Sunday night where it's a little bit cool and horrible, I hope that you have enjoyed your weekend and suddenly you're starting to get back into the life of variety and fun back at work. Of course, those people working at home, I'm sure you're still going crazy and hopefully now you can soon get back to work. So today I was down in the shopping centre and let me say it was crazy, absolutely crazy. And it does show you that things are starting to get to normal. For those people in the entertainment industry, unfortunately, we still haven't got back into those venues like we want to. Don't forget to check out places like the wonderful uh, Dine and Show, uh, of course, which is being done at the original Midnight Shift, which has uh, now changed its name. I'm trying to think of the name. Uh, and then don't forget, also, the shows are back on at Stonewall uh, in small numbers, of course, for the amount of distance that they have. If uh, you're looking for somewhere to go, then I suggest you probably Google it, and that'll be the way to go. I thought I'm going to start you off with something that gets us in the mood, something that's a little bit special, and I'm going to start you off with a little dance do you want to dance? Do you want to dance? Hold my hand Tell me I'm your lover man Oh baby Do you want to dance? Through the night, and baby, do you want to dance? Do you do? Do you want to dance? Do you do? Do you want to dance? Do you do you do you? You see, under you, under that floor with me, we're gonna dance together, make harmony. Do you want to dance under? bring back a lot of memories for those oldies that used to dance constantly around 
If we all now were cooped up for winter, but I tell you, this summer is going to be great. I'd like to say hello to all my friends overseas as well, because I know there is a lot of people over there at the moment that are in lockdown that still can't get out and about, especially all my gay friends and my lesbian friends, bisexual, transgender, intersex and queer. I think those are, we'd like to say hello to them all across the world during this week or well, this month, of course, is Pride Week here in Sydney. And of course, through Pride, we celebrate being every colour, every sexuality and every race. So we do like to say that. Now, I would like to sing you another little song, which I know that you're going to enjoy. It's a really old fashioned number. And I, tonight I decided I was going to- Oh, what a feeling. and exciting and wonderful and brilliant. And we've got a few people to say hello to. We're just going to check online. Of course, we're going to say hello quickly. Oh, we've got it here. Oh, you're not Don Lane. Oh, lovely Ethel, isn't that gorgeous? Ah, oh, it was far too long. Your intro I had to leave the broadcast. That's all right. We do, unfortunately, have a bit of a long intro because we have to get everything ready here in the studio. And we've got Derwin Princess. Oh, lovely, Teddy. Beautiful sister. You're looking beautiful. Oh, so beautiful. That's lovely. We'd like to say hello to all our friends out there, of course, across the globe. And we, I'm going to finish with this number now. This is a beautiful number that I've got a bit of a sore throat actually, so I'm not sure how I'm going to go. But either way, we're going to, I'm going to sing this song that I'm dedicating to President Trump. It's true. 
It is a horrific song about when the men went to war and how that they may not have come back. It's a famous Elvis song, and it's as tragic as it is, it's a misdemeanor and memory of how bad America is mucked up at the moment. So we do think of all our prayers and hopes to all those beautiful people in America at the moment. And we do hope that no matter what color you are, race you are, or who you are, that you can travel safely and with love and without harm. And this is a song. Oh, I wish I was in the land of cotton. Old times, never forgotten. Look away, look away, look away, Dixieland.
Please, enjoy the rest of the show. We'll be with you shortly. Hit me twice Ooh. Hit me three times Ooh. Oh yeah share in Jesus together as we light the candle. 
the holy candle. This candle's broken. This is not a holy candle. It's a broken holy candle. Isn't that beautiful? As we share together in these wonderful words, I hope you can hear me nice and clearly. Who have I got online? We're going to have a look and see who's going to be saved tonight. It's all about being saved, isn't it? Who have we got online to be saved? Let's have a look. Oh, we've got some people to be saved. I can't find them on my tablet. <laughs> oh, here we go. We're down the bottom. We've got Trevor. Trevor and Celeste, she's online, isn't she? She's on Universal is the name, wasn't that? Universal is the name of that midnight shift. That's it. I knew that I knew that she would know that lovely Felicity Brockachee. If you haven't seen Felicity, you should see her. She's available online, I think, on Friday nights. Is that right, Felicity? Make sure. We've got lovely David, David Clark's online. He needs to be saved. He needs to be saved from himself, doesn't he? As we share. That's right, we've got Phil. Phil's online. Oh, it's all. Go on, Have a look here. Oh, dear. I think I, I don't know. I've just... <laughs> Can't get it to work. Ah, oh, who else have we got online there, Matthew? Who else have we got online? <laughs> Trying to fill out some. Here we go. Oh, I was up to the right part. All right, that's all right. Lovely Kylie. She's online. Isn't that lovely? All right. I should really get the word. Oh, it's better. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I'm just trying to get all tonight. Aren't I? I'm trying to get all tonight. Oh, have you got some holy wine there? Are you going to share with me some holy wine? We need some holy wine together. Who out there hasn't had their holy wine this week? Very, very important that we do get some holy wine to show this buddy. Ah, uh, looks better on the 50 inch. Monica! Monica, the mole's there with Loretta. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, Monica. You need to get yourself a light beverage, darling. You need a light beverage from saving yourself for the week. Let me read something from the Bible for you. Let me read something this week. It's going to be beautiful. Now I'm on a run. <laughs> I was off a run. But now I'm on a run. Aren't I? This one's Psalm 38. Oh, it's beautiful. It's my favourite. It is. I love Psalms. I love every psalm, every father and psalm, I do. It's beautiful. A lot of priests like psalms, don't they? They like young boys, don't they? Dirty perps. That's right. Here we go. This is Psalm 38, 51, 6, Psalm David, to bring the Lord to memory. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that lovely? Hallelujah. Beautiful. He said, my wounds stink. <laughs> That's true. He said, my wounds stink and are corrupt because of my foolishness. I met a girl who had a dirty vagina. She stink. It's true. I'm troubled. I'm bowed down greatly. I go mourning all the day long. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that lovely? I like mourning too. Especially around about 11 o'clock. <laughs> Lord, all my desire is before thee, and my groaning is not hid from thee. I like a bit of groaning. Do you like groaning? <laughs> Hallelujah! Hallelujah! And the word to be long. Yeah, I'm not on 
Mm. Hallelujah! Isn't that lovely? That lovely Lydia, she's on. We've got Gary's just joined us. It's nice. Ivy to two sisters who. She's on. And lovely Nikki Farchwar. She likes that Nikki. She likes to dine at very posh places, doesn't she? She likes to dine at that posh French restaurant in Oxford Street, that Claire's de Lou. True. I can't afford that. Call me now. Call me now. What? 300, my God. So I can spread the word for 49.95 and I can dine at lovely establishments like Claire de Lune's restaurant. La Salon. I can. Call now on 1300, my God, and dial, dial, send money. Because every donation this week gets a free lick. Thank you. On the smelly piece of paper. That's a beautiful. Hallelujah! We can't afford those expensive things. That's why here, here at Bottom Ministry, we have to do what we can do. We're on very strict budgets here at Bottom Ministry. Tight, tight we are. Uh, we've got my lovely sister. She's on there. She's on. She's a, she's a sister in waiting. She is. She's going to join the nunnery soon, she says. But she's getting none at the moment. Isn't that lovely? Oh, I've got something to read to her because her vagine's dried up and we want to try and fix that for her. So here we go. Are you ready? Here we go. That's beautiful. Quarren's on. I've said I miss one night of alcohol. That's terrible, boy. We need to give you something to save yourself, don't we? Here we go. Here we go. Wonderful are your commands. And therefore your soul keeps it. Isn't that nice? I have no fucking idea what that means, but that's beautiful. That'll save you. Ain't it done? It'll save Hallelujah! Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I've missed one night of alcohol. Alright, it's time for communion. Time for communion. We need communion. Don't we? We need a bit of communion. To Jesus. He had Jack. Didn't he? Jesus had Jack. Took the Jack. And he ate it. Hallelujah! No. And then he had a bit of water. Jesus, Jesus! Mm. Nice. Beautiful. Isn't that lovely? Alright, I'd like to read you something now. Read you now, we've had communion. It's only a short communion, it's not. It's not a roast stop. Mary's making a roast. We're having a Jesus roast. That'd be nice. Mm. Got a Jesus roast, so we've got to make it quick. Mm. Jesus wrote this book. It's a great way to cook the steak and chops. He wrote this book. He wrote it. It's beautiful. It is got lovely. This one's roast beef with celery. I'm looking forward to that. I am? I don't know about you. But I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Jet stuff, Jesus. Four pork chops, one roast, one onion, butter, mushroom, celery soup, sour cream, salt, pepper, throw it in a pot, and off you go. There we go. Hallelujah! Beautiful. Isn't that lovely? Mm. Alright. Because I've got a roast. We better go to the news. Looking forward to the news. Join us now for the Bible News.
hotel room with millions of dollars worth of illegal drugs. There was drugs, jewellery and fake identification. Hard to believe. Paul Lur, Paul Lur, 29, appeared in the Brisbane Magistrate Court on Tuesday, where he faces drug trafficking, weapons, offences, and allegedly found 60 kilos of cannabis, methamphetamines, cocaine, cash, and $200,000 worth of jewellery on the December the 23. People from Ark Nightclub have caused an outrage that their supplier may be due late Unfortunately, because their cocaine will not be available by regular delivery of Australia Post, they are now asking the Queensland Police to be able to take possession back of their cocaine stash, which they'll need for opening night. We hope that they find some solace in that shortly. And more in the news. Aldi's have come under fire because they're selling a $2 something or other enzyme spray which can be used for more than just stain removal. Ladies from the CWA Kmart Appreciation Society have caused an outrage as one person found that their dye san pre-wash stain remover also cleans the shower recess. It has caused a lot of trouble, unfortunately, because as one lady, D. Mary, was giving her husband a blowjob in the shower, accidentally took in the dye sand shower spray, which is not a shower spray, but a stain remover, to get the sprog off the windows and realised it worked immediately. It's caused an outrage across all Audi buyers and we hope that they will be able to get over it soon. And as far as I'm aware, they're looking into how it might get rid of coronavirus if, of course, inserted by needle. And also in the news, Australia Inclusive Employers. This is a big problem that has been part of Australia. The Small Employer of the Year and also the 2020 Australian LGBTQI Inclusion Awards were announced last week. These are about the diversity in services and business and inclusion on how they support the LGBTQI community. It's true that it celebrates its 10th anniversary of the awards and it has some very big businesses. Employee of the Year is RMIT University. Most improved was John Hollow. Platinum employers were Commonwealth Bank, Per WC, and Your WA. Beautiful. Lovely. If you want more information, as boring as that story may be, go to starobserver.com.au find out more news. And also in the news. Brazilian tourists plead guilty 
in an only fans revenge porn case. It's true. Former Emirates flight attendant Fabrico del Silva Claudino alleged that in his cell at Silverwater Jail, while he has been charged allegedly for revenge porn. It's true, the matter was heard at Burwood Court last week. He's due to be sentenced at the Downing Centre next month. Police charged Da Silva Claudio for filming consensual sex with his boyfriend on his iPhone. He couldn't understand how to get the screen clearer as he'd had an accident earlier. Uploading multiple pages of his ex-boyfriend naked to his only fans. The Silva Claudio's ex-boyfriend was unaware and was being recorded and the video has been leaked. Terrible. Personally, I love porn. I think there should be more people sharing illegal porn. Beautiful. And that was Bottom News. <laughs>
Well, that's it for this week. So I hope that your week is fun as ours. Sit back and enjoy your week as it starts. Till next time, my name's Sandy Bottom. Great to have you. I'll see you next time. Good night.